In this video, I'm going to install ESXi 7.0 on VMware Workstation Pro 15.5.6 and then create ESXi host virtual machines on GNS3. We will have two ESXi hosts installed. One will have vCenter server appliance, therefore will require more memory, 13 GB minimum with four CPUs and two hard drives. 100 gigabyte for the operating system and 500 gigabyte for the vCenter server appliance. The second ESXi host shown in this video will contain three tiny Linux used for testing. The first thing to do is download ESXi 7.0 ISO image from VMware website and then install it on VMware Workstation Pro. Click on File and create a new virtual machine with the following information. Hostname ESXi70H2 CPU 2 cores 4096 megabyte of memory and 100 gigabyte of hard drive space. During installation, accept all the defaults if not specified. Set the first network adapter to bridged and then add three more adapters and set them to custom VMNet3. Set your CD slash DVD to use ISO image file, then browse to select the image you downloaded. Power up and do as prompted. Press F2 and configure your network with the following information. Network IP address 192.168.1.32 Subnet mask 255.255.255.0 Gateway 192.168.1.1 
disable IPv6. Primary DNS server 192.168.1.4 Alternate DNS server 8.8.8.8 Host name esxi70h2.plaza.local DNS suffixes, plaza.local, and reboot. On GNS3, Create a virtual machine, ESXi70H2, using VMware VM template. Change the symbol to classic server. Adapters to 4 and first port name BMNet0. Drag and connect the newly created virtual machine to the workspace and test for connectivity. Note, once you power up the ESXi host, GNS3 will change your network adapter driver from bridge to VMNet. You need to immediately change it back to bridge as it boots up. Mm -hmm. 